What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the server browser in Battlefield 2042. I know a lot of you out there like myself, you have the early edition of the game, but a lot of you I know will be coming to the game this Friday when the standard edition drops. And there's not a traditional, at least right now, traditional uh, browser like we, we're used to. Because if you go to the war, uh, warfare, the all-out warfare kind of section here, which I know a lot of people will be participating in, this is where of course you play you know your things like Conquest, Breakthrough. You even have the option here to go into solo and co-op uh, lobbies. In case you did not know that, good way to warm up. Just uh, kind of a little bit of or a little bit of a tip there. Uh, if you're looking to warm up every day when you get on, that's a good way to do that. But there's no traditional kind of you know just server browser here. So this is kind of just a quick play option. that's going to throw you into a game. The only way you can find a server browser is over here in the Battlefield portal, which of course is one of the coolest things that I think DICE and EA have ever done. The portal is absolutely awesome to play some of these old modes. But you actually can tab over here to the browse section and then search within this parameter. So you can go, you know, to all Conquest, Rush, uh, Rush Custom, Follow, that kind of thing. You can go down here and actually hit the search itself and pick, you know, your region max players. So anything. So let's just go in and, and do like a... We'll do any here, any there. Uh, we'll go over to tags. We'll tag 2042. We'll tag all the game. We'll do custom logic. Why not? Uh, you can kind of, you know, find a little bit of everything here. You know, your restrictions, your general, you know, friendly fires, a lot of hardcore uh, modes in this as well. A lot of people have created those. And you can go over here and pick which maps, what modes. So we're going to go everything but rush. Let's just say that for now. And then it's going to, of course, pull up a server browser or it might make a liar out of me. Never mind. It did. Um, but this is how you kind of look for a particular game. Then, of course, you can go across the top and do recommended name, mode, map, players, ping. But as you can see, of course, it is kind of early in the morning for me. Uh, there's not a lot of servers right now. But on the right side, you can kind of see uh, what is on, what's going on within that server, if they had any of the rules changed. Uh, I was hoping that there would be more servers here because anyone can host a server, as you can see. You just kind of go over to host. These are not like servers you have purchased or you did purchase back in the day with Battlefield games. These are just servers that are here that you can host on your own. You can actually follow those. I followed a few that were some pretty cool old school and new school maps for Team Deathmatch, which was a lot of fun. It was a good way to go in and, you know, kind of just rank up some guns, trying to figure out some of the maps, kind of learn some of the weapons. So I was running around playing some of the old maps from some of the old games, some of the new maps. And that's a pretty neat experience. There's also been a lot of bot farm servers in here because people are, you know, bot farming to rank up their weapons. Now EA has kind of put a a stop to that they've, they've lowered a lot of the xp you gain from that but at the same time i've not seen a lot of custom servers where it's just you know conquest and things of that nature uh maybe a few rush here and there from bad company too that's a lot of fun i know a lot of people prefer to use the server browser personally i love the server browser and i'm hoping that dice and ea will add a server browser to all out warfare where it just has your traditional ea servers where it's just you know default gameplay and then if you want to go into more of a custom kind of heavy game you actually can go to the portal but as of right now if you're wanting to use the if you're wanting to use the server browser the only option you have here of course is going to the browse of uh, a feature in the portal itself and of course if you want to play some other things there are options here within the portal of course you can go through the collection if you want to play different modes in the portal but if you actually want to search the server browser itself this is the only place you can do it Hopefully, they'll give this uh, a look and change this up uh, in the near future. Anyway, leave me a comment and let me know what you think about this. Do you like this option? Do you prefer, uh, you know, the older way where you have the you know, option to do a quick play and, you know, server browse from this, you know, particular menu if you're wanting to play Conquest or something like that? Leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course, the affiliate serial and channel Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. Also, check out the merch store, which is linked in the description as well. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.